and welcome back to A Play Tale. So we are continuing from where we left off last time. This is chapter 8, Our Home. Our Home. This looks nice. You're having a bad dream. Are you... are you awake already? Yes, I found lots and lots and lots of things. Come and see, you'll really like them. Sure thing. I wonder what our nightmare was about. Come on, come on! What's that noise? Okay, it's Lucas. one second. Follow me, you'll see. Right, this will wake me up. Hopefully. Down here! So, the gang found a castle. Our family castle. Hugo's face is definitely getting a lot worse. A green lion devouring the sun. I hope it's not a prophecy. Ooh, what prophecy? The purpose of this process in which vitriol attacks sulfur is to separate the crude substances from the subtle ones. Okay, nice. So what are we going to look for, Hugo? I do not like these spider webs. There you are. Sleep well? Not a wink. This laboratory's in bad shape, but it inspired me. I'm on the brink of completing the great work, and you, you can help me. He sounds like oh, a really yes, old yes. scientist. What do we have to do? Amicia, I need the file from the left hand table. Uh, all right. And me, and me. What can I do? We need light for the last step. Hugo, go get a candle. I can do that. There's candles right there. Oh, I, that must be it. Here, anything else? Uh, yes. A concentrated laurel sap. It's just behind me. I'll get it. What's a great work? Can I eat it? It is the elixir that will illuminate your path. A beacon for the bearer of the macula. It came to me during the night. Here. Good. So, the angel's tear. Pinnacle of alchemy. The elixir. You Wow! The great work! Uh, it wasn't supposed to do that. Uh, it doesn't matter, Lucas. Perhaps we uh, should let you rest, right, Hugo? Well done, Lucas. You're a sorcerer. Amicia, come on. I'm coming. What's down here? Amicia, where are you going? I'm it's exploring. It's alright, you can come. Where does that lead to? So what happened to the brother then? Arthur? We kind of just left him behind? Oh, a grave. A spooky grave. I don't know. We can say something if you'd like. Sorry to disturb you. We don't have any candles, but we will leave you in peace. And thanks for looking after us. Come on, let's go. That's sweet. A trophy called Tribute. I'm not sure who that was. Probably one of their family members. I thought we would have checked out everything just in case to make sure it's safe to call home. But I guess we know it's safe already. Maybe. By the way, have you seen Melly? No. Uh, she's... Maybe she's already gone. Oh no, I wanted to say goodbye to her. Where are you going, Hugo? Wow, this castle must have been empty for centuries. Free real estate. <gasps> wow. Come on, Amicia, let's both do it. No, <laughs> let's not shout our whereabouts, but sure, let's do it because the game is forcing me to. Ah! 
Having fun, are you? I'm sure the Inquisition are too. Melly, We thought you'd gone! Come on. We need to talk. What's the matter? This castle is a ruin. Ah, and that's exactly what you need. Whoever built this place really didn't want to be fucked with. Be good and you'll be fine. So, you're going to find Arthur? If I can help, he's my problem. You heard what I heard. Those Inquisition dogs took him to the Bastion. I know where to look. I'll find him. Amicia, look! Listen, with Hugo, it doesn't look easy, but believe me, it's worth it. He will save you. They always end up saving us. Even if, you know, brothers, sometimes you just want to kill them. The symbol is Amicia. I believe you. Can we just ignore him? Anyway, don't leave without saying goodbye. <laughs> As if that was my style. Amicia, please come. Yes, Hugo, what did you find? One second. Down there, it's the drawing. What drawing? The one in the dining room. I'll show you. Come on. Um. Okay. Okay. You. He's zooming. Uh. Goodbye. I guess. If this is the last time we see you, hopefully you come back because you're a handy help to the team. All right. Where did Hugo go? <laughs> where did Hugo go? You're right. Alchemist coat of arms, maybe? Have you seen the tree? The tree? Come on, over here! Ah, jeez. <laughs> He's been exploring. He's having fun, at least. <laughs> <laughs> Come back! Where are you going? <laughs> Aww. You found new friends. Yes! <laughs> That's so cute. I'm sorry. I'm sick. No, no, no. Oh man, his his neck looks really bad. Listen, we are going to find a way to cure you. And there's Lucas and Melly now, you know? Lucas, come see the butterflies. Looks like someone's having a good time. <laughs> Getting bigger. <laughs> yes. The macula is spreading through his blood. The books say there are several thresholds in the process, and at each threshold, the carrier may be lost. How much time do we have? Very little. Hugo is nearing the first threshold. My master and your mother were trying to slow the process down. But how? What were they doing? They were working on a very complex elixir that would allow him time to prepare. And do you know how to do it? I don't have their knowledge, but their work was inspired by a forbidden book. The Sanguinis Itinera. So perhaps, with the book, I'm afraid could... not. The Sanguinis Itinera is dangerous. It is sealed, together with other works, in the university basement. Just getting there would be near impossible. Suicidal, even. Normally, yes. But if we take advantage of the current chaos, we might have a chance. I know the place. It's in town not far from where they keep my brother. If you're ready to take that risk, I can help you get in. Thank you. Right. I'll get my belongings together. Meet me inside when you want to leave. In that case, you'll need some equipment. I'll get it ready. Hugo? I'm really sorry. I need to leave. Don't worry. I'll stay with Lucas. Good. I'll be back soon. Okay, we're going on our first adventure without him. Hopefully he'll be fine here. What have you found? Here, it's St. John's Wart. 
Oh. It will protect you when you go to the town. Uh -huh. Must be powerful stuff. Yes, it's a very good flower. It looks good on you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Father, mother, <laughs> you'll always be here <laughs> with us. <laughs> this is so sweet and so sad. Okay, so let's hopefully go get some stuff for him, which is going to be a literal suicide mission <laughs> against zombie plague rats. Alright, I'll see you later, Hugo. It feels weird leaving you, so yeah, <laughs> I'll be back. Oh, I just remembered! It's Detroit, the game I was trying to think of in Chapter 1, uh, when you're Kara looking after the little girl. That's what this reminds me of when you're looking after a sibling, <laughs> taking care of them, making sure they're okay. So yeah, now it kind of feels weird without them. Oh yes, the things we found. This will stop us losing them in all the mess. And yeah, I love Detroit. Played it three times, got the platinum as well, just to make sure I did all the different endings. Be careful in town. It's probably more chaotic than here. Don't worry. We girls know how to handle ourselves. I'm sure you do. Good luck nonetheless. Thank you very much. Uh, okay, so I guess I just leave. I don't think I was meant to come here. Alchemist lived here. Maybe Laurentius too. He laughs extremely loud, unless the castle is just very small. It's like he was upstairs and I can hear him laughing still. Oh, there you are. At last. All right, come on. Here. And one last thing. Laurentius told me once that there are roses scattered along the path to the book. So keep your eyes open. Roses. All right, we will. Oh, okay. Um, okay, that was uh, that chapter. That was very quick. I did not expect it to be that short. I am very sorry, but I will end it here. And I will see you next time in The Shadow of Ramparts. And hopefully we come back with everyone alive and the book and everything will be fine. But I have no idea. I have no idea what's going to happen. So, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you stopping by today, even though it was a short one. I hope you have a great day or night wherever you may be, and I will see you next time. Bye!